Welcome back to the Don and Gino Real Estate and Finance Show right here on your hometown station, AM 1220, KHDS. And remember, our goal is always to guide you to personal and financial wealth. Well, thank you for joining us for the entire show. That's right, the Don and Gino Real Estate and Finance Show right here on your hometown station, AM and FM, KHDS. And you can find out more at hometownstation.com, or you can find out more about our show now, seven years running as of this weekend. Thank you for being part of our show. Seven-year anniversary. Who would have thought? That's right. We have our custom-built studio right here at Skyline Home Loans in the Sunkiss Building right by Magic Mountain. You probably hear the screams of the, of the kids riding on the coasters right now. And we've, our goal has always been to help you with guiding you to personal and financial wellness, helping guide you to a beautiful thing called home ownership. And we do that with the best people we can possibly find. And one of them we brought right here on our show, Scott, the mortgage doc, Edwards, one of our top mortgage professionals that chose to join our Skyline team and share with you how to be successful in trying to find and buy your first home or your next home because it's challenging out there. And hopefully they listened to our last segment that gave them all yeah. these tips and tricks. I agree. How can I they agree. get a hold of you if they didn't? So my phone number is 661-373-1034. And that's probably the best thing to get a hold of me with. Call me or text me, uh, send a smoke signal, whatever works for you. <laughs> it's got the mortgage dog with Skyline Home Loans. You can also find us on Facebook. Yes, Facebook, all um, of that. Yeah, all that stuff. So in closing, Scott, I love that you brought a different topic because I know it has changed your life and, mm -hmm. and, and you make me feel good because I got you kind of on this path. Absolutely. But a lot of people don't do this and, and it's, it, it's a challenge for them in their lives because every year, mm -hmm. I guarantee Every one of us, including myself, every year go, I want to have an amazing next year. This right. next year, you got to start a fresh start, and you want to crush it. You want to have be a better person, a better father, a better husband, mm -hmm. better at your job, make more money, be healthier. I can go down the list, right? Sure, absolutely. Almost all of those you want to be. With more more faith-filled, more related. Whatever it is, right. there's a, a plan. Now, each of you have your hot spots, your most important ones. And what I like, Scott, is that when you align with your business partners, mm -hmm. one, you did it yourself. Yep. You created your own vision board, your own business planning, and we went through a business planning yeah, we did. and asked some tough questions at sure. times. And you're you're very open. I love mm -hmm. that's the that's the key. It's like going to a therapist and lying to him. <laughs> that's not the thing to do. Don't go to your attorney and lie to him. So when you're doing your business plan, you have to be honest with yourself or honest with the person you're talking to. And you were very honest with me. Mm -hmm. We was sat down when we first started with Skyline and said, Hey, here's some important topics I want right. to I want to learn more about you so that I can help support you in that direction and guide you in that direction any way I can as yeah. your manager. And you said, "Let's do it." And you sucked it in like you I mean it was you took ownership of it like I've never seen before. And what I, what's even more beautiful is you're like, "Hey, that did me a lot of value. Absolutely. I'm going to share this with all my partners and anybody else I can." So, why don't you share that experience so that you now share with all your um, team members and your basic business partners. Absolutely. So it was it was a great experience to do. I mean, and, and thank you, Don. I mean, it really was um, sitting down with you and going over my business plan. Um, it's incredible, right? So, I mean, we talk about setting goals, but if you don't write it down, if you don't have like that vision board, if you don't have it in front of you, if you're not reading it on a regular basis, it's 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 top of it's not in your mind anymore, right? Well, so how you do you don't hold yourself accountable? Exactly, and you don't. I mean, it, you have to be have something in front of you on a regular basis to keep yourself accountable. And I got to be honest, I, I hit a certain goal for March, and I'm close to hitting that. And it was because it was and always top of And that's after a mind. slow start because you just Correct. transitioned to Skyline. Nope. Just, hey, we're doing like this marriage thing. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, by the way. Thank you. Thank and you, you married up. Yes. Yes, I did. I did. She's incredible. Thank you, Brooke. I love you. <laughs> um, but, yeah, so no business planning. So what I did was is I've adopted that into doing it with everybody. Um, so I've done it with, uh, I mean, all of my business partners. And I even had a, a friend of mine's son come in, and we did a plan for him for him to get his CPA license. Nice. So um, it's simple enough, but uh, direct enough so that you can walk away with something. And it is something you get personal with. I and mean, we talk about, and I always am transparent, so I will tell them, here's what mine is, mm -hmm. right? So that, because we're going to start getting, we're going to ask some personal questions, and I want them to know that I'm right there with them. So uh, my favorite part, as much as the numbers are great, we narrow it down to their hourly and what they need to make and all that kind of stuff. But my favorite part is why. Oh, thank you for that's mm -hmm. a that's a great way to end the show. Mm -hmm. 
because there's we all know business plan. I'm sorry. All of us have done it. All of you out there right now are going, yeah, yeah, you're going to ask me my income, what my goals are, how I did, blah, blah, what's most important to me. But that was a good point is why do you want to be healthier? Why do you want to make more money? Why do you want to be a better father? Why do you, all those things. Why? Right. Once you write your why, did everything else become easier? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Because you went off to the races once you had your why. I did. I did. It's like having an outline to a book. Now I can write the chapters. Yeah, exactly it. Yeah. Couldn't have said it better. All right. Well, thank you for being such a positive in- inspiration to my team here because they watch you. You don't stop. You obviously love what you do. You're really good at it, and you're only getting better at it. Mm-hmm. So, again, how can they reach you? Uh, 661-373-1034. And I am all over Facebook for Scott the Mortgage Doc. <laughs> and uh, other than that, that's it. All right. Well, thank you for being a, a great part of our show. Thank you for being part of our seventh anniversary show. Woohoo! And you can find out more by going to donandgino.com, D-O-N-A-N-D-G-I-N-O.com. There's so much information on there. And go to our YouTube channel, over 2,000 YouTube videos, and we do it for you. Thank you for being part of our show. Have a great weekend.